Hello, sacred souls. It's Susanna from Alemanic Shaman. What I have here for us tonight is a continuation of yesterday's. I was actually going to do a fire ceremony. And um, as I was heading towards that park where I usually do them, um, I was diverted and ended up close to home. So I took that as a sign that tonight was not the night to do the fire ceremony. Um, and then as I got home, or when I got home, I saw my one shirt, because I had done laundry a few days ago, and I still had one of the shirts hanging there. And, um, sorry, I gotta rewind a little more. Um, so when I uh, told you yesterday, I, um, earlier in the day, I had two astral attacks where I was being astral strangled, and I actually couldn't breathe in 3D until I had unwrapped the loops of the scarf around my neck both times in the astral realm. So it's like I saw it in my third eye, and I unwrapped it in the astral realm, and then I could breathe again, right? So after that... I did the ceremony last night, and then right before I went to bed, I had some gummy worms that were in a tub. Um, I actually forgot the tub in the car because I was going to throw them in a the fire. But um, this morning, there were three on the floor that I hadn't seen because I picked up. They were everywhere, like just everywhere. And I picked up the three this morning that I saw on the floor, but I didn't see that this one actually fell onto the hanging shirt that was hanging there. And look, it was exactly where the neck is, right? So I I knew already that I had to like slay the astral snakes. And I was going to do that at the fire ceremony. But I didn't realize to this extent or to this degree how much they're trying to like get in there and you know get their fangs in there so I do have two wooden snakes that shall symbolize the astral snakes and since it is really late again and my neighbors are home um, I'm not going to use the axe I have it more for decoration just sort of to show I'm going to snap their necks Okay. Um, luckily, these wooden snakes are easy um, to actually snap just with the, the hand. So that's what I'm going to do. So I'm going to snap their necks and then they are done. And um, earlier today, I also found this flower and oh, I forgot to look it up. Um, sorry, in German, it's not okay. I think it's carnation in English. Um it's red, so red is the color of love, but um, at least in my culture, they're usually put on graves, right? So I knew that um, that dark stuff needed to be put to rest, as we did yesterday in the ceremony, but it needs to be buried and finished. But first, it has to be D-E-A-D. -E Right, It has to be finished, gone, done, what we're going to do with these astral snakes here tonight. Okay, and I had made three candles with the wick of, like, that I had infused with the intention of forgiveness. So the second one is almost burnt down, and you can see it poured all over. But what I find important and interesting is that it looked like it really opened up almost like um, a flower or something. It's like we're opening up energetically in a good way, right? Um, but I will actually light this last one, the third one that I had made. Also like out of paper cups. See, other people's garbage is another one's treasure. I was able to upcycle them so to speak right or at least reuse them whichever way you want to look at them anyway um so i'm gonna light that uh, um but i'm actually gonna light it after the smudging 
And I think that's it for explanations before I really get started. So let's smudge and get this done. some of the sage. Oh, it's a little bit close to the curtain here. But yeah, when I saw that gummy worm, and I knew right away that it meant a snake, right? And I knew I was dealing with two snakes. Um, oh yeah, while I'm getting this ready. Um, for me, and I think a lot of people would agree, um, the the toxic evil snake energy is pretty much like the devil energy. It's that toxic, narcissistic, manipulative, controlling type of energy. Maybe the snake energy has more the manipulative component now that I'm talking about it. But um, either way, like dishonest and kind of that devil type energy, right? Okay, I think we have enough smoke now, so please cleanse and renew all of our energies and take away anything dark, evil, and low vibrational and flood us with massive amounts of healing light, unconditional love, blessings, and protections from the divine. And so it is. Thank you. Dankeschön, all my relations. Dear Creator, higher power, source, and soul energy, our higher selves, our higher spirit guides of the light, dear Mother Earth, dear ancestors that are in the light, and great spirit of the fire, as well as air, earth, and water, please join the ceremony and assist the healings and prayers with all of your powers. Thank you. Please close the circle of protection around us. Thank you. Oh, and right away, as I smudged, um, I knew that I had to actually also bite the head off this one. So I'm going to start with the gummy worm. Okay, the head is bitten off. The head of the evil astral snake is removed. But since, like, at least in my case, I was dealing with two sn evil snakes um, attacking me, let the evil astral snake be removed from both of them. So from the one person and from the other one. And let them be Put into these wooden snakes. So let this uh, this wooden snake be the manifestation of the first astral snake that was possessing that first dark evil narcissist that was astral strangling me. And that shall be applied to any and all of you as well. So the first person that the evil narc that was trying to attack you through the spirit realm and tried to unalive you in whichever way shape or form that might have taken place let any and all devil and snake energies be pulled out of them and put into this wooden snake and by the highest divine power vested in me, it is sentenced to die in the 3D, 4D realms that we occupy. So these astral snakes have no more business here. We cast them back to hell to burn in the fires of hell for all eternity or until ready, able and willing to move into the light for healing. Okay, here's here goes the first one. And the same thing for the second one. Let any and all devil type snake energies 
and entities be pulled out of that second person that has attacked us through the spirit realm and tried to unalive us on an astral level by the highest divine power vested in me they shall be those astral snakes shall be dead in the 3D and 4D realms they do not have the right to inhabit these realms anymore on Mother Earth, on Gaia. They are reserved for us humans. And this devil type snake energy has to be cast back to hell to burn in the fires of hell for all eternity or until ready, able and willing to move into the light for healing and so it is both evil astral snakes are now slain and cast back to hell to burn in the fires of hell for all eternity or until ready able and willing to move into the light for healing and they shall be bound there for all eternity in in hell until they're ready and able and willing to move into the light. And after that, they shall be bound into the light. Either way, they shall not be able to return into our reality, including the 40. And so it is. Thank you. Dankeschön. All my relations. Ah. to be there and the flower whoa and that's actually already entangled look at that okay here we go <sighs> that shall all be put to rest may it rest in peace and may it heal please we ask all the divine love and light to enter them as much as possible to help them heal and so it is thank you danke schön all my relations and our last or my last candle that's infused with the forgiveness energy the intention of forgiveness shall now be lit And just like the Olympic torch, that shall now be put to rest. May those dark energies rest in peace, but stay out of our lives now and forever for all eternity, throughout all of time and space, throughout all lifetimes, timelines, parallel and alternate realms, realities, multi and universes, and any and all other aspects that affect us in this lifetime and moving forward. And it shall apply to body, mind, spirit, soul, energy field, and any and all karmic aspects. And so it is. Thank you. Danke schön. All my relations. Ah, ah. Mm. us in all the divine blessings, our gifts, our abundance, our love and light, our joy, our happiness, our good luck, and everything else that these dark ones try to snuff out, eliminate, and finish. All the damage shall be reversed, and we shall be so massively filled and surrounded by 
the divine love light energy and frequency and it shall form a massive protective shield all around us and that shall be sealed in with a divine seal of protection we are now completely safe shielded protected and loved by the highest divine power and so it is thank you danke schön all my relations all our relations oh. okay let the ceremony now be finished and accept our love thanks gratitude and blessings please open the circle of protection around us but keep us strongly safe shielded and protected and so it is all my relations all our relations okay everyone thank you so much for watching for being a part of the ceremony and for working on your own healing if you like this video please give it a thumbs up share and subscribe and i'm also sending you tons of love and light many blessings and be well until next time bye